Hello, my dear brothers and sisters, welcome again. This is Roti, the legend, aka the kingpin, the only in Angurai. Today, I'm in a I'm in a place known as Gulu. Gulu is located in Uganda. So we have a walking tractor, and you know what we normally do? We always cut off the weight by removing the handles. So I've reached here very late. As for now. We can't do much more, but uh, tomorrow you will get to see or you get to understand what we're talking about. But stick to the channel and see what happens here in Uganda and Gulu. <laughs> Guys, this is Jomo Kenyatta Street Road in Gulu, Uganda. Oh. So guys, welcome again to this channel, Rodi the Legend, aka the Kingpin, the only engineer in Angura. Yesterday, I told you that we were running out of time for us to to do the setting of the, to change the handles, what I mean, yes. So we managed to change the handles while the tractor is still on the pickup. So right about now, we just want to drop it down. But uh, we are in a village where we were supposed to do the demo of plowing with this working tractor. So meanwhile... Stick around and see what happens with this walking tractor here in Gulu, Uganda, northern part of Uganda. Yeah, man. Stay tuned. So guys, you remember what I was telling you is that today here in Gulu we are changing the handles and also we are going to do the modification of changing the plow which is here. So this plow here is just the same as this one. But the only difference with this is that uh, this is how the weight was shipped from China, so it normally seems to break every time here, and also it has so many settings. You can see there is a place where you do the setting here, and also there is a setting point here. So for us to minimize that uh, thing of setting every every place and also getting away from damages to break the the joint, I had to do something like this. So for this one, you only have this setting here for raising the plow up and also lowering the plow. And now, as you can see, the only difference is that we had to cut it off from here and then we had to join another part. And now that is the way we did our modification here. So we are now going to change this frame. To this one here but all everything you see the plow disc and so on they are coming to this one here stick around Mambo, <laughs> <laughs> 
Nikiwa na check grease anyway nilifikia na na pay wa hoka wa hotel lakini ya nyoka local tongo in for bale yani gia hapo kai kipongi in kai the full dispatch right yeah yeah sure yeah yeah kipongi in kai kai bene kipong kai bene nene wa kitu na di ya check grease me the tie in north america kwa wiki ya mere ma
Guys, we have already do done the, have already done the demonstration on how this plow is working, and it has actually shown us that it's capable of doing a lot. And uh, far as I can see, it has done a quite tremendous job here. So you can see here. This one is almost at load for the last 30 minutes we have been demonstrating here teaching my boys on how to operate the tractor and as you can see right about now they are using another mold board plow this one is called a single mold board the one they are using right now so to find out how capable is the mold board to do the plowing and also to compare it with a disc plow, a double disc plow. So the one who is operating right around is a green learner. He has never done it before so he knows nothing about the working tractor. So we are trying to teach him and to mentor him on how to operate it. But right about now, the one in a blue t-shirt, that is the owner, the boss. So he's trying to give him some experience on how the way he should operate it. Remember this is Gulu, Uganda, northern part of Uganda. Yeah, stick around and see what happens.